was like, like Renaissance rock or something. <laughs> I grew up in the country. I was raised predominantly by my grandmother my yeah. whole life. And it was a pretty laid back childhood, but um, as far as the way life was in that area. But for me, you know, things were kind of hard because my family wasn't all, um, they didn't really have a lot of money or nothing. And the house that we grew up in, it was kind of like, the roof was kind of leaking water and stuff and things were just hard for us. And uh, well, I guess I made it out of there, you know. Yeah, how old were you when you left? I was about 20. Start as a fiddle player, or as a accordion player, because you're pretty good well, at fiddle. Well, I started off playing uh, guitar. That was my first instrument, mm -hmm. and because my grandma couldn't find a fiddle that she could afford, so she got me a guitar and told me if I learned chords and learn how to play, uh, that she'd give me a fiddle. So she bought me some Cajun recordings and some Zotico and stuff, and I showed her that I could play. And I said, uh, now I want a fiddle. So I, she she told me if I found one that was affordable, I could get it. Yeah. So I went and found one in a musician friend, and it was like seventy five dollars. She got it to me, she got it for me. And uh, it was like in the summertime, I remember. I was about 18 years old. And I ran to the post office. I'd go like every day, you know, is it here yet? And they're like, no, it ain't come in yet. And when it came, I was like, yeah. And I ran down the road with my fiddle. Got home and started scratching around on it. And, yep. <laughs> There is some sort of a divide in some ways between Zydeco and Creole music mm -hmm. and Cajun music. Mm -hmm. And what's interesting about what you're doing is there doesn't seem to be that divide in either in your band and the makeup of the members of your band mm -hmm. and also in the styles. So you kind of mix a little bit of both in, in ways that not a lot of the old timey musicians used to do. Well, everybody in the band, we all friends and stuff and we all play, come from different musical backgrounds. Some of us may come from more, you know, Cajun or country, some may come from more R&B or jazz. And when we all came together, we just kind of came up with this original sound of what we got. And um, that's the way it worked out, you know? Yeah. And I mean, I guess you can just say it's a gumbo. It's mixed. Ha, 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 ha.